They really do like the offensive line up front. Mm -hmm. A cutback run here from Dabika, able to find the hole. Stand his feet, good balance from him. Finally thrown out of bounds beyond the first down marker. Game one, I should say, against Bryant. Now Conway will try to bounce it outside. He has the edge. He'll get towards midfield. Knocked out at the 49-yard line by DeMetal. Again, another first down for the Sharks. Allen Duquesne trying to adjust. They get their players to the line of scrimmage. Just one man down on the line of scrimmage. Dabika cuts through. Gets the 35-yard line, picks up another first down. Well, they the lone wide receiver towards the right side of the formation. Reagan stays up top, though. He's got Eugene. Actually make it economy again. Breaks one tackle down at the 6-yard line, or the 11-yard line, just shy. They get it into the red zone. Connor Barrett back in for Duquesne. Two linemen down. Roll out for Reagan. Throws towards the pylon. And good coverage on the far side of the field. Nowhere for Eugene to go. They had the touchdown, and... They used a play on film. And the kick is up, and it is no good. They pushed it wide. So about five minutes left in the first quarter. Time here for Reagan. Oh. Completes the pass nicely across the 40-yard line, tumbling down after the catch is made by Derek Eugene. All three split out right in front of you. Now Reagan feeling some heat, gets rid of the ball. Oh, and he got his helmet knocked off from Todd Hill. They're going to call that roughing the passer. I, I thought he still had the ball in his hands practically as he was releasing it, and he hit him low, I think. I think the pressure point is going to be whether they get to it, we'll see. Another low snap. Reagan handles it again. Out in the flat, it's to be. Can he get around the tackler? He can. Stays in his feet, but is brought down at the four-yard line. Actually, going to say he stepped out at the six. Let's see if they run it back again. And it looks like Reagan's going to keep it. He'll try to get across the goal line. I don't think he got in. I don't see any indication. Yeah. The linemen are saying he's no. in a late call. Now they're going to say that he got in. Another look. He was, he's got a, he had a second blocker there. I got him in. I, I, it's almost impossible to yeah. tell from that angle. Next to Henderson, next to us, right in front of the play-by-play -play booth. Dropping back is Mishler. He'll throw it downfield, and it's caught! That's Cyrus Holder into the clear, perfectly placed ball, and it's a touchdown for Duquesne. They answer with a big play. Cyrus Holder, 75 yards in the score, and the Dukes are an extra point away from tying it. Call it on the Holder touchdown. And Jennings gets it again. And they're going to mark him just shy, I think, of the first down marker. No, they're going to move the chains. All right. Right now for the Dukes on first and 10. Their half of the field. Reagan drops back, pump fake. Now he'll go deep, open receiver, and it's incomplete. They'll call pass interference. The stop and go from Tosin Oyekonomi worked out very efficiently. He takes the snap. Oh, he oh. stepped out of his shoe. He goes right down. Garson will touch him down, but his knee went down anyway. His shoe came right out from under him as he got stuck in the turf. So Hunter. He'll take the snap. He'll drop back. Has some room to run if he wants to. Now he decides to throw it anyway, deep into the end zone, incomplete. Oh, I thought Regan could have run for it, Ellis, or at least come close, as that one was intended for Oh Economy, and it was incomplete. Grunting. Now Mishler has some time, throws oh. it deep, and it's intercepted on the far side of the field. And they're going to throw a flag. Was he looking for his marker and threw the? Now it's going to be Sneed on the interception. I just thought the ball was up there way too long. Yeah, Sneed on the pick. Point. I think they're feeling good about their defense. Reagan sets up, sidesteps the pass rush from Durazio. Now we got a flag behind the play, and Regan goes out of bounds. And this is going to be a hold, I think, in the process of the scramble from the quarterback, Regan. Yep. First time on this drive. Showing blitz. Easily recognized the pass to Isabella. I don't think he got there. Oh, generous spot. He did not get that spot. Oh. <laughs> he did not get that spot. <laughs> now Mishler has some time, delivers a strike oh. to Holder. He's in the open field again. Holder out in front of the defense. He's got himself to 10, and he's going to go for another touchdown. The second long pass, catch, and run from Mishler. To Holder, 60 yards and a score, and the Dukes are up by a touchdown. Down now for Duquesne. And they'll give it to Owens again, who spins through a tackle and is eventually brought down by Aaron. But only have five in each pod. Another pass, another catch as Mishler going to the air here as they need to with one minute left to go. Henderson after John made a reception. Yeah. 
Oh, somebody jumped. This might be a free play for the Dukes. Mishler senses it, throws it underneath to Henderson. He cuts back across the field and gets to the 10-yard line. A QBR of 223 already. And that pass oh. is deflected, and it's caught for a touchdown. Oh, what a lucky break for the Dukes. Jana caught it after it was deflected. I think it was intended to Henderson, and it was caught for a score on the deflection. Certainly do. In 2019, with your great call on that, and that ball's up there. Rico Aaron with the play, I oh, believe. He can't, he can't stand it. That's what I would. And a good start. To, oh, no, the tackle is broken there. Dabik actually has a chance to turn this into a long run as Dabik is now taken down at the 28-yard line right away. As soon as we talk about the rush defense, they penetrated. They read it right, but they could Regan bends down to get the snap, and he'll loft it deep into the end zone, and it is caught. Oh, what a catch in the back of the end zone. It was contested by Dower, but the catch was secured and brought in for a score, and it looks like it's going to stand. They might here if this, in fact, holds. They decline the penalty, and he caught it over wow. Dower's head. He gets the foot in. Actually, oh, might have gotten both, both feet in. in. Rolling out is Mishler. He's got room to scramble if he wants it. Now he decides to throw. Coming back for it is Henderson. Hit ball that turned into the touchdown. Mishler will give it to Owens. Cuts it back. Now he's got a crease. Owens gets the first down. Still moving. An entire host of LIU Sharks finally brings him down. Mishler awaits the shotgun snap. Now he has it. Surveys. Lofts it up deep again. And it's caught by Isabella. Sliding catch at the three yard line, and the Dukes are set up first and goal after the third and nine conversion. Thing that LIU came in preaching that they wanted to stop and not allow happen. Mishler hands oh. it off to Owens, and he gets across the goal line into the end zone. Touchdown, Duquesne. They pay off the big play to Isabella 27 14 with one to be tacked on. Six more for the Dukes. From the 48. Henderson comes in motion. They give it to Owens anyway. And now he scampers all the way across the 40-yard line. Uh -oh. Let's take it away. Allen got it. Isabella is able to knock him down. Holder able to tackle him. Nice play, though, from uh, Rico Allen. Going and going. You'll see after the contact. I mean, it, I mean, okay, I got a sundial already. Oh, great play by Rico Aaron. Fourth quarter. Now suddenly LIU has life again. Bounce it to the outside. And up towards the sideline, now getting pushed out of bounds. It's Dominic Jennings back in the game. All before he did, so Jennings secures it after the fumble. He'll hand it off, and nice. there's some space going. A cutback, nice. plenty of room to run. And Oof. finally brought down as DeBrito makes a touchdown-saving tackle. It's Paul again. Receiver comes in motion and stops. That's Dobbin. Now Regan throws it out to the tight end, and he is brought down after a short gain, Glasgow. And the extra point is up and splits the uprights. So 28-17 for Mishler. Steps back a few hops and now decides to throw it deep again to Holder. Makes another catch just beyond the 50-yard line. And they're going to say he's in, got the one foot down. Big gain for Holder again. I uh, had him marked down from our first game as seven. But he wears five and he's in there right now. There's the sh short pass and good stick again from... Rico Aaron. Enough to Owens again. See some traffic. Bounces outside. Able to use the stiff arm to pick up the first down. Now Owens is back in gear again after the fumble. Very good. Or were very good. Matt Fitzpatrick, one of them. He's coaching right now. Another stiff arm from Lucas. And he's dragged down. Losing yardage on the third and two. That'll well, bring up an interesting decision here. High snap. Placement down. Kick is up. And it is... No good. It sailed outside of the left upright. You can at least say you're taller than him. I don't know how the rest of it would go, but you're taller. Yeah. Oh, open space. Oh, cut it. Oh, the ah. economy. I was going to cut it toward the middle. To be cold zone this time. Pump oh, he's got him. Regan. Got a receiver open, and it's caught at the 40. Now pushed out of bounds at the 35-yard line. Another good pump fake. Dobbin this time, the redshirt senior, is able to bring in the pass from all the way out to the boundary. Give to DeBeek. He waits for the block to develop. Now stiff arms himself. Oh, the action goes all the way out, almost toward the bench. To, as I recall, 
be a one ca one catch for Glasgow, as I recall, in the red zone. Oh, uh -oh falling down, Regan just hung this one up and it's intercepted. Oh, uh, Debrito fell down. He had some room to get, but Debrito will take the interception. Of times today. Debrito's gone off today. Now Mishler again looking for Holder, and he's got another one. Holder dropped to the 45, but another big gainer for the wide receiver as Mishler hit him perfectly once more. Uh, pardon me, uh, Rico Aaron. Holder again picks up the first down. Simple slant this time. That's as conventional as it's been for Holder. I think he had something on special teams if I remember as well. What a pocket. What a pocket. And it's Henderson on the big gainer this time as he's tackled at the 15-yard line. Speak to it, but of course... You know, to your point about the defensive uh, pass defense, here we go. Heavy formation, and Owens will take it in for another touchdown. 34-17 Duquesne with 142 left. They get that uh, elusive touchdown here in the fourth quarter that we were talking about earlier, mm -hmm. and the Dukes are happy about that. A little bit of breathing room here to wrap up the contest against the Sharks. Good blocking out front. Is that O'Malley leading the way there? 